Hi, my name is Eurus. I'm an electrical and electronics engineer with over 50 years experience in power generation systems. This is a follow-up video to the first one where I demonstrated this so-called zero-point generator. To remind you, I'll show you a short excerpt of that video. Here it is. I'll plug it into the PowerPoint. Now, the PowerPoint is on, but the lights are off because the generator is not working. To start a generator, we have to screw in the receiver, then give it a manual turn. The generator will now speed up until it develops enough power to activate the modules and provide electricity. This generator will work indefinitely with no cost and no maintenance. The rest of this video might not make any sense unless you've seen the first one in its entirety. If you'd like to see it, just go to the link that you'll see on the screen now. You can always come back to this particular video a bit later. YouTube is filled with hundreds of videos showing machines that claim to produce free energy. Many of these so-called inventors are selling plans for their machines or asking for money to further their development. Unfortunately, all these videos are either jokes or outright scams. Devices that produce energy out of nothing do not exist as they break the laws of nature. Unfortunately, most people have little or no understanding of basic physics, so are easily fooled by these scams. As an experiment, I decided to see for myself how easily people could be fooled. I built my machine and put it on YouTube. I was amazed at the response I received. Obviously, some people did not believe it. One such person who calls himself Skeptical Open Mind made his own video in reply. He was extremely rude. Let me show you. This old guy here you see in that video, he needs to make it for the retirement. So he needs to have collect some money. Well, I hope he dies as soon as possible because we don't need any more. He then stated that he'd made a better machine and had the audacity to sell it for $4,000. Check that out. It works. We're having electricity for free guys with this simple device and it's for sale on YouTube. $4,000, yes, for this guy. Apart from the previous, the vast majority of people who watched my video did believe that my machine produced free energy. And that can be seen by the number of likes against dislikes. I even had personal phone calls from a major bank and two power providing organizations offering me any amount of money to further develop my machine. I had to tell them that the video was just a joke. In fact, it was a major worry to me that so many people believed in the impossible. And that finally convinced me to make this revelation. So in future, if you are introduced to such machines, please be skeptical about any claims until you have indisputable, valid information. Out of the hundreds of such machines that feature on YouTube or elsewhere, none have ever passed independent scientific tests, verifying that the machines are in fact producing free energy. I'll now show you why my machine is not what it appears to be. All right, here are all the components. Firstly, these are normal 240 volt LED globes. I had to use LED globes simply because I didn't have any incandescent globes left in the house. This panel is a DC to AC inverter. It converts a low voltage, like from a car battery, into 240 watt AC that can be used around the house. The only thing I've done to it is to add this module. It introduces a time delay of about 10 seconds before electricity is produced after the devices have been switched on. It is there for effect only. I've now disconnected that module so this device should produce electricity as soon as it's switched on. 
this is not a generator. It is a battery pack. Inside there are six lithium ion cells producing about 30 and a half volts of electricity. In the front we also have a small motor which turns the rotor, which is there for show only. At the back we have this switch. It's not a receiver or antenna, it simply connects the battery to the DC AC inverter. I'll now connect it together. I'll plug in the lights. Now obviously oops, turn it on. Obviously because the timing module has been disconnected, this should produce power immediately it is switched on. And there we go. You'll also note the rotor does not turn. It has nothing to do with power generation. It is therefore show only. If we spin it, it will speed up and appear to be doing something. I'll turn it off. Unplug it. And I'll now show you what is inside the device. screws that hold the end caps on. I'll now remove the front first. Here you can see the lithium iron cells and in the front we have this small motor that turns the rotor. I'll now open the back and you will see a back view of the same cells And of course, all the wires that connect everything together. I'll now remove those cells. Two can be removed from this side, and the other four, four from the front. It will be rather time consuming, so I'll speed up the video now. There. All the cells have been removed. All that's left inside are the six retainers for those cells. Once again, the view from the other side. Okay. It's a simple device, but it fooled a lot of people. Perhaps they should have known better. If I now connect this together, obviously nothing can work. <laughs> there is no power uh, to go to the DCAC converter. Well, that's about it. I'd now like to finish this video on a slightly lighter note. Obviously we'll need a battery pack to provide energy to the DC AC converter to provide power to the lights. What if we don't have any batteries or lithium ion cells or similar? Can we use something else? Well nutritionists tell us bananas are full of energy. Can we use a banana to power the device? Let's try. Okay, here's a selection of bananas. That looks like a good one. Put lots of energy in that. Let's see if it fits inside. It does. With ease. Sticks out other end as well. Now I wonder what is going to happen if we try and turn it on. Okay, let's do. How about that? 
What about the rotor? It looks like we have genuine banana power. I wonder how many kilowatt hours we can get out of a banana. I'll pull a banana out. Keep smiling and have a nice day.